Ready for your next steps in kiteboarding? The transition is the first move you learn after riding upwind. Not only does it look better than sitting in the water for every change of direction, it also helps you stay upwind by avoiding another water start at the beginning of each tack. You initiate the transition by riding hard into the wind. Edge hard by leaning back, increasing the pressure on your back heel. Your speed will reduce and at the turning point of the transition, your board should be pointing straight into the wind. As the kite starts pulling in the opposite direction, switch your weight from your back foot to your front foot, which will then become your new back foot. Progressively edge your board and start to ride upwind again. As you ride hard into the wind, bring your upper body progressively closer to the bar. This will centre your weight over the board and make it easier for you to switch your weight from the old back foot to the new back foot. Simultaneously pull the bar in, which will give you lift, lightening the pressure on the board and making the weight switch easier. As you ride into the wind, progressively steer the kite into the zenith or 12 o'clock position. Timing is essential here, so make sure the kite passes through the zenith at the same time as you switch your weight from the old back foot to the new back foot. Once the kite has passed through the zenith, Dive the pipe harder to accelerate out of the turn. Edging is a key element in the transition. The most common mistake is not edging hard enough as you initiate the transition. If you find yourself sliding rather than cutting through the turn, you need to put more pressure onto the heel of your back foot. This will bring you to a halt before you switch your weight from your old back foot to the new back foot. Standing upright or leaning forward too early will flatten your board which will make you slide and trip over your front edge. Time your weight switch so that it occurs as you come to a halt and the kite passes through the zenith. Not pulling the bar in during the transition will not only make switching your weight more difficult, but also stops you from redirecting the kite quickly enough. The kite needs to pull you through the whole transition, so it's essential to redirect the kite early and aggressively enough in order to keep the line's tension.